In this video, let's see another numerical problem based on rate of change of quantities in application of derivatives. The question says, a particle moves along the curve 6y is equal to x cube plus 2. So basically, there is a curve given to you and a particle is moving on it. Now it says, find the points on the curve. Find the points on the curve means on that curve, 6y is equal to x cube plus 2, wherein y coordinate is changing 8 times as fast as x coordinate. So this wording is very important to understand. y coordinate changing 8 times as fast. Let's write solution and let me make you understand. It says the change in the y coordinate it is 8 times as fast as the x coordinate. Doesn't it mean like that? Right? So this is equation number 1. What about the equation of the curve? Equation of the curve equation of the curve is nothing but 6y is equal to x cube plus 2. Now since this is the curve given to you and you have to use this knowledge to find out the points. So for finding the points we have to differentiate. So 6 dy by dt is equal to d by dt of x cube and plus 2 being a constant does not make any difference to us, right? So 6 dy by dt, what is the value of dy by dt from 1? It is nothing but multiply by 8 dx by dt and that is equal to the differentiation of x cube with respect to t. So it is 3x square dx by dt and what is this from the knowledge that we used was from equation number 1. Now certain things cancel, dx by dt goes with dx by dt, so it is nothing but 6 multiplied by 8 is equal to 3x square, 3 goes to the other side, so basically it is 16 is equal to x square or x is equal to plus minus 4. Now some students leave the answer here, which is not right, why? Because they asked you about the points, not about the axis only. So you have to find the x coordinate also, you have to find the y coordinate also. So when from here, let's move further to the solution, when x is equal to 4, when your x is plus 4, what is the value of y you have to compute? 6y is equal to 64 plus 2, am I right with this? 4 4 is a 16, 4 is a 64 plus 2, so 6y is equal to 66, y is equal to 11. What about when x is equal to minus 4? Similarly, when x is equal to minus 4, what is the change? 6y is equal to x cube plus 2. 6y is equal to x cube. That means minus 4 cube, which is minus 64 plus 2 this time. Please do not make any mistake in copying the sign also. That's very important. It is minus 62. Or you can say y is equal to what? We can cancel it in the 2's table. So it is minus 31 upon 3. So you have these values of y corresponding to the values, different values of x. But the answer is not left here. The answer is you have to find the two points. So the two points are what? The first point is 4, 11. And the second point that is required is what? It is minus 4, comma, minus 31 by 3. And that is your answer. So obviously you'll be writing the whole statement that the required points are the first point and the second point. But the concept is important that whenever you have the rate of change, it is talking about the differentiation of that first quantity with respect to the second quantity. 